hey this is CG1 and thank you so much for joining me once again. I want to talk to you about three key lessons from the life of Richard Branson which can help you to be successful on your own journey. And it's quite interesting because Sir Richard Branson actually um, was born on 18th July 1950 and at just 16 years old he would drop out of school and start his first real successful business a student magazine company which he ran for several years to generate enough money which then he would start off the more comp the company that we're more familiar with the virgin group a hugely successful company that owns over 400 other businesses in various industries from health to media to all sorts of various things and it's quite interesting because he Richard Branson is so successful in various things that we just look at successes but not recognizing how and what lessons we can pull out and that's why I want to share with you three key lessons and the first one is overcoming your handicaps so the reason why Richard Branson dropped out of school, or big reason, is because he was getting bad grades and he wasn't succeeding academically. And that's because he has dyslexia. But what he recognized was that despite his significant handicap, he wasn't going to let that stop him. Many of us, when we've been through a very bad experience, maybe we have a learning difficulty or we have something that can we can use to hold us back we use that as a way of being a victim but he recognized that something that I always remind people of that greatness is not the absence of handicaps but it's the ability to overcome your handicaps and the overcoming doesn't mean you eliminate it because it, it might not leave you but like Richard Branson you find a way around it where he recognized that going through the academic route is not for him and that is key finding what fits you because successful people not only know what they're good at doing their strengths and does it but they also recognize what they're not good at doing and find people that can help them do it the second lesson that Richard Branson teaches us is learning to delegate to have over 400 companies under the Virgin Group, he, he must not, for instance, know everything about those 400 companies, but he has great people around him. And in his reflection about how he deals with dyslexia, he, he said something that really is powerful. He talks about, and I paraphrase that, having dyslexia gives him one key advantage. The advantage of knowing that there's certain things he can't do so what does he do he find great people to help him do it that's like I said it's a successful person you learn to delegate it frees up your time it allows you to do more but even most importantly it helps you to do what you couldn't have done without the aid of others that's the power of delegation and the final lesson I want to share with you from Richard Branson is my personal favorite and for me probably the most important one and that is knowing yourself. See it counts for nothing to be able to overcome your adversity, to be able to delegate if you don't know yourself and this is about personal identity so let me do my best here to help you understand with this lesson that knowing yourself is the first and foremost the most important discovery you can make about you because you can know what you're good at doing what you're passionate about what you're not good at doing what you don't like and be able to understand that this is what you need to do because rather than being you you are being somebody else and there's nothing sadder than trying to fit in rather than knowing that you're born to stand out because our uniqueness makes us who we are it gives us our unique selling point our value 
And Richard Branson is one that recognizes that man, he doesn't fit into this mold of just having one business and just have been in this one industry and just working with it. He understood his, his passions, he understood his skill sets, his talents, his giftings and roll up, ran with it. I want to share with you that overcoming your handicaps is important not to be a victim but to take responsibility and find ways around it. Maybe it might not be eliminated but you can overcome it. That secondly, you can learn to delegate by knowing that not one man is an island and that one person cannot truly create something noteworthy or massive or be successful just by their own one effort. And then finally and most importantly, knowing yourself is about understanding your characteristics, your personality, your, the traits in you, discovering who you are and discovering how you fit in this world and being true to yourself and sharing that. Because success is about discovering who you are and then helping others to also have that freedom to be who they are. Sir Richard Branson, through all his success and overcoming of his challenges, can help us too on our journey of success. This is CG1 and you have the seed of greatness.